three, two, one, two, three. Okay. Hello. Welcome to Disguy D2. And I'm in a really uncomfortable position here because I'm recording this on my television and not my computer monitor. So, I've got a microphone balance to go on my bed because I haven't got a second monitor yet. And I will get that once I have a desk. So, yeah. So let's start. The netherworld. Darker than a pitch black cave. Deeper than the depths of the seas. A land where ominous demons run rampant. In the past, this world was ruled by an overlord with unrivaled charisma named Krichevskoy. After this great overlord passed away, many demons rose to become the next overlord, plunging the netherworld into an age of chaos. It was then that one demon announced his claim to become the next overlord. Wow. That demon was Laharl, the only son of Overlord Krichevskoy. He crushed every demon that stood in his way and forced himself upon the title of Overlord. He was helped by Angel Trainee Flan, and after many twists and turns, the Netherworld and Celestia started interacting. However, because she had harmed other angels, Angel Trainee Flan became a fallen angel and moved into the Overlord's castle with Laharl. A few years later... Was that why she became a fallen angel? I thought that was because she got killed and then brought back type thing, but I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Getting in the first game sort of a bit meh. Well, not meh, it's good, but it's sort of like leaves how did things carry on from there because if you don't know how it ends it's sort of uh longest end to a flower type the whole thing she's dead and then he murders the seraph who's the person who did that too and then he's saying you shouldn't have done that you know what uh, she wasn't really gonna die and um, but i think the whole like sacrifices himself for her or something like that and then there's like a after the credits type thing, when the hall comes up as a pretty, so I don't really know what goes on there, but yeah. So, there you go. There's your disguise knowledge for today. Hmm. This is strange. They should be sprouting soon. And here's Flon. I had them send me UEA flower seeds all the way from Celestia. Did I plant them wrong? No! It's probably because I haven't given these flowers enough affection. Sure, Flan, sure. I shall nourish these plants with my overflowing love! Flan's kind of a love fanatic, if you can't tell. Here you go! Drip, drip! I love the pretty water can. Nice entrance for the hall. I think that's his like ultimate move in the first game. Meteor in fact where you just ride a me meteor right in into the ground. And the people. Well, demons. All people, I suppose. No reaction for a meteor hitting you hitting behind you. And so is the pain, I suppose. Says the guy who r rides in on a meteor. No! What are you doing, Laharl? <laughs> ah! <laughs> Surprise! I destroyed every star in sight! Good for you, Laharl. Good for you. Apparently, the demons in the netherworld haven't realized that I've become the overworld. Yeah. Really? He killed like quite a lot of them when he was becoming overlord, so I would have thought quite a few people know. If I show them proof of my absolute power, they won't be able to help but admire my greatness. Alright. I don't care about that. <laughs> Very little interest. Who cares? The whole nether 
world belongs to me, the Overlord. I decide what gets destroyed and what doesn't. You're terrible! I wanted to show you my favorite flowers! Prince! And here's Edna. With the cool music. Which it moves in the first game. enough to kill you. I would have killed you a long time ago. Fair enough. You are, as always, a terrible vassal. Anyway, Prince, most demons can destroy the stars, you know. You can destroy as many stars as you want, but no one will accept you as the Overlord just for that. Damn, they're stubborn, are they? What? Are you saying that all my hard work has been a complete waste of time? Yep. Absolutely. Oh, Flan's not happy. Why did you tell me that earlier? It's a vassal's job to keep an eye out for stuff like that. And the how and then they're so completely just ignoring her. Oh. What's wrong, Flan? You're shaking. If you gotta pee, you really shouldn't try and hold it, you know. She's right. That'd be a bother. Really? You know, you... Alright, yeah, it is. Please apologize to the celestial flowers that were trying so hard to sprout. Celestial flowers? You planted these things right under my nose? Yes, I received some new hay seeds. Although subtle, they bloom into very pretty white flowers. Um, Juan, flowers from Celestia don't bloom in the netherworld, you know. Ooh, that was a bit of a waste of time then, wasn't it? What? Good for you. I saved you from wasting your time. You should thank me for that. He's right, Juan, say thank you. Don't ask, don't tell. Well, yeah, but... I love that she just accepts it. Not to mention, I'm busy. I don't have time for flowers. That's right. You need to hurry up and get people to treat you like an overlord. Huh. Just you watch. I'll show every demon that I am a much superior overlord than my old man was. I thought I think his father was supposed to be the overlord, so we'll see. Wait for me! I want to come too! Oh, that's not good. You're not supposed to bloom there, are you? Episode one: the qualities of an overlord. Makes me know to be a dick, kill a lot of people, show off your powerful, all that sort of stuff. I think. Maharo, how are you going to show all the demons that you're a superior overlord? Hold on, first things first. There are way too many demons who don't even know that I became the overlord. So, I've decided to have monuments celebrating my ascension to overlord set up all over the netherworld. No, oh, I know. I ordered all my vassals to get to work on that non-stop without food or sleep. You get very good working conditions if you work for it, not clearly. Prinny squad, get your asses over here. I'm here at Prinny's. Master Edna, is this good, dude? Prinny's are... Yeah, I think it's... Is it just human souls that have been a bit, eh, bit sinful? So they go to the world as a pretty, and then they are basically slaves until they get enough money to but um, buy their souls being cleared or whatever. I think along those lines. That's not exactly right, but along those lines. Wow, that is pretty good for you guys. Yeah, they got the outline right. It's our 
don't say masterpiece. Oh god, that's a derpy as hell face. It's a really derpy looking Lahar. Lahar. What? You're the one who told me to make Lahar statues. From a distance, it looks like him, I guess. Look at the antennae. They look exactly like yours, right? You can't argue with that. Shouldn't you focus on the face? <laughs> No, faces aren't important. You know, everyone's face looks exactly the same. This is amazing! It looks exactly like Laharl, especially the antennae. <laughs> Can we not focus on the antennae so much? It looks enough like you. Don't be so picky, Prince. Yeah, no one's gonna come look at it closely. They'll just look at it from a distance. It's fine. It's fine. Damn right, it'll do. Now, go erect these Lahar statues. <laughs> the face looks so terrible. Prince, I'm sure you know this already, but let me just make sure. You want to go outside castle, dimension guide, open dimension gate, direction of buttons or stick, camera controls, main menu to save, all that sort of stuff. So it's all good. And we are in the castle? I think it was it. I think it's the second game we introduced where you can find treasure chests around your place. There's 50 hell, which is the currency. And let's talk to this pretty. Why can't there just be, um, be in game magazines like that? I want to play games all day, dude. Okay. I don't know why I like a music block or some music thing appeared. Oh, I don't know. I'm rambling. Ooh, a bomb. So here's Lahal's bed. Mm. Is there anything secrety around here? I think there's some secrety type things in the first game. I'm not, not sure. Where are all the cool vassals? Uh, here's one. Castle entrance, but not as usual with castle. Understand, just two ways to guard the entrances. Yep, clearly. <laughs> Who has it? A bed pops out at 12 o'clock. Good figure, it. I've never seen Hans move. Fair enough. Alright, uh, castle's changed a bit since the first game. Walk behind the counter and take this. Hundred more hell. Cool. King Gujarat uh, was the greatest person. There are demons who still look up to him. I think they're up to something. King Gujarat is still really popular even after his death, huh? It feels like without him there is no overlord. He says that right in front of the hall. Oh, dear me. Let's talk to Jack. Even though there haven't been friendly relationships between Networld and Celestia, there isn't much immigration on either side. No sane demon wants to go to Celestia. There are some angels who come over here. They treat us like we like we're a haunted house. What? There are some yeah, okay. Okay, that's enough salt on the woman. What we got here? We got paparazzi and memoria and those on. Okay, that's enough talk on people. This video's already been going for like 15 minutes, so I want to try and at least do it a little bit of something. So here's your shop, your healer, who you will want to visit a lot. All the construction. Oh, I can't buy stuff. My 100 health. So we're going to have to go through all of that again. Let's save. Things have definitely changed through all the games. There's been like five this guy games. Uh, first one, uh, uh, there's like a PSP remake. Which is basically the same thing. But a few little changes, like you could have different things happening if you did such and such. That made no sense, but... Uh, um, 
And there was this guy two, this guy three, this guy four, and now this guy D2. Uh, different characters in second, third, and fourth games. None of them are as good as this one. Uh, as the first Sky game characters, I should say. Please select your push Okay. Uh, uh, the hell that I'll skip that one. Mm, what should I? No, I'll do, I'll do it. Mm. Oh, I'm debating about that. Oh, whatever. Mm. Oh, I know what to do, though. Screw it, I'm skipping it. Here I come! Can't do special shit? No, that sucks. So, it is a turn based game. And you control. Oh, I can't lift yet. God damn it. Um, what? So far, and you're always saying we should take and um, tore things out. But look at the, uh, look, you're fighting. It's okay. I, I'll just apologize afterwards. Does that make it okay? Okay. No, she only has heal, so that's not good for me right now. Prince, I'm um, going to the bathroom, okay? You're trying to sit out of this battle. Well done, Prince. It's all right for my scheme. Uh, you can suck up to me later. I go destroy the enemies now. Fair enough. Oh. I think these enemies poison you. Hey. And they tend to evade your attacks. Maybe they don't poison you in the. Uh, what you call it? What's the word for it? Um, God damn it! Um, God damn it! Demo? No, not demo. Um, intro. First, I'll just say first level. So after each battle, you get hell, and you get a bunch of stuff, depending on how well you kill the enemies, and later on, geo banners, and all that sort of stuff. Prince, now what hospital? Open the yeah. Okay, cool, so I can buy stuff now. And I can heal up. That was a hassle. Cost you money. Shops of weapons. Healing items. Weapons equipment. Upgrading. You can talk to somebody about weapons, he's pretty informative, of great. Okay, I don't need to. I know all this from the. First game. Here we all get prize. Can't get any prizes yet. That's really changed from the first game. First game just like randomly sold once in a while. And I'm gonna skip that. Sorry if you want to see that. Basically just like you sell your crap, you want good stuff. I don't want to talk to you, I want to talk to this guy. Let's skip that as well. Okay. Right. So. Let's try this on the whole. It loses him some damage. We can afford this. Eight extra damage. Yeah, got him. Scroll it. And that's literally all we can afford. I really don't want to die in the opening of the game, but you know, never know. <laughs> so let's save again. Uh, I'm presuming that's the item wonder person. Uh -huh. So this just came out today. Oh, I'll do this one, why not? It just came out today in the UK. I'm not sure if it's been out previously in America. I it's been out in Japan. Over there! Let's get him. Kind of far. Our heads. What are we gonna do? We're gonna throw each other, I'm guessing. Oh. God, I can't bother watching all of that. I'd rather just skip it. It's just telling you. I'm presuming it's just telling you. You can do this. And they've definitely changed the lifting bit from the first. 
Yeah, and from the other games. That like you can throw diagonally, I properly shown that now. Oh, I can't bloody. Carts can be thrown, these boxes can be thrown too. Yes, they can. Aha! These drives are my power. Yeah. You dead, buddy? Okay, let's attack the box. I think there's some items you can't break. Like, if the metal box, I don't think you can do enough damage to break. Mm, not 100% certain. It's been a while since I've played any other Discard games. Oh no, he's done a slight bit of damage to me. The horror. The horror. And now he dies for it. Alright, let's try and speed things up. Go on. Throw it over there. Oh god, you're dead. Perfect. We've got common daggers and hell for it. So, pretty much after every battle, I will be healing, but it's advisable. Data shop's now open. I don't, I actually don't know about the data shop. Data, data, what else? All sorts of stuff, like activities, lifts items with the chain, records, most damage, skills we've seen, change music and bass to the world. Uh, the guy's name is Paparazzi, okay, so visit him when you have time. Okay, okay. Don't really care about that right now. No prizes? Nope. Right. Uh, Prince goes to Neverworld Hospital. You should heal your HP and SP. Or else you'll get beaten off. I already have. My drum business. Save the game before starting battle. Always eat a run in. Okay, do whatever you want. Maybe I should save off. Save off. Yeah. Fine, I'll listen to that now. I will save. It's really not important at this point because I don't expect to die. But you know, later on in the game, if you are getting some more difficult areas and you know. Oh yes, I, I just beat this very hard level and you die on the next one and you go, Oh no, I didn't save! Ah, the horror! I'm going to skip this because I know about Geo effects. Basically, these are the Geo prism things. These are Geo panels. You know, you throw one of these on there, yeah. I guess that's a vect. You break them, it turns all those that colour. Alright then. So, um, first of all, let's throw that there. Here I come. And I've got nine HP. I think Fawn can deal with that. I think. Yeah, she destroyed that. I hope it's gonna be. Oh yeah, no, no, it's not. God damn it! I messed it up. Bugger. Yeah, I messed it up. Oh well. Who cares at this point? Here I come. We're not gonna get anything amazing. I thought you cleared them all. Shut up! I don't like think about confusing things. Yeah, I kind of rushed it. That oh well. That was silly of me, but. Meh. Nah, I'm going to put these in there. Put these kind of crap. You can just throw them to blow them off and stuff. Alright, everyone's ganking the hall. And I think he might die. Yep, he's dead. I shouldn't have to fight. We should just leave these weapons to the prince to deal with. Well, since the prince just died. And uh, I think you should probably help. Just saying. No, you don't want to attack it. What are you doing, Flon? You're crazy. 
Oh, that was pathetic. Pretty, dude. Uh, oh, that's a speed boost. Why the hell? Um, you can do it, what's something about his bait, I guess? Seeing as Lahal kind of died. There you go, see? He was... he drew their attacks, he's all... He's dead as hell, but who cares? Right, so if I die on this, I'm going to be very upset. It sure is! So there's a team attack. And he got murdered. Let's see, can we get pretty in that particular team attack? Oh, we got one. That was pathetic, Brinny. Oh, cover attack, I don't, I'm not so sure about them. Did you see that? That was a support attack, by Increasing the likability between characters that will help with your attacks. Okay. That was not in the old games. I know a little bit about this game from watching Marcus slash Epic Name Bro play the Japanese version. That's about it. I'm negative. Let's have a look. So, got a decent amount of health for that. No, let's not skip the demo. Let's actually see this bit. Weaklings taking up my time like that. Well, we won, so all's well, right? Yep, sure is. The statue is up, and I'm getting hungry, so let's go back to the Overlord's castle. Oh, who's this dick back? What? My majestic statue has been. I wouldn't say majestic, I'd say. nice from a distance. I can't allow you to do this, Prince Lahar. The fact that you are the Overlord's son does not grant you permission to erect these statues. Doesn't it? Why not? Who the hell are you? I think the other was dead, Have you so. Forgotten? I made a name for myself as an advisor to King Krachevskoy. I am the noble demon Grosso. Grosso. I remember him from the Japanese <laughs> On YouTube? Advisor? Grosso? Hey Etna, do you remember him? I do, but <laughs> I don't know. King Krachevskoy had a lot of vassals. I can't remember every single one of them. It's understandable. <clears throat> anyway, you, youngster, are not cut out to be Overlord, the ruler of the Netherworld. Hey, you talking smack. With that being said, I shall rid the Netherworld of all these eyesores. I hope you understand. Nope. What? I'm already the Overlord. You can't talk to me like that. What's up to beat his ass? Destroying my statues is a felony. Are you ready to receive your punishment? Ooh. Still so full of energy. You haven't changed at all. I'm sorry to say this, but I can't afford to waste any time. Oh, yeah, boy, boy. Your children should just go home. Don't interfere with our business. I'm pretty sure the home is uh, like a couple thousand years old. That 1741, sort of. Oh, you missed. Set a lot of speed. Looks like that guy's gonna be a real pain. <gasps> Do you think he's trying to become the Overlord too? Maybe. If he was, instead of destroying the statue, he would have just fought us. Yeah, good point. I'm also curious about what he meant by our business. He's got friends. Hmm. I don't know what he's up to, but I won't let him destroy my statues. Quick, after him! Okay. Prince Stark Assembly. Okay, I think that's for you. Yeah, get your business done. <laughs> uh, new characters. Um, what's it called? Reincarnate, all that type of stuff. Right, the whole down so let's heal more. Ah, we've got all the fucking heal after that. Okay, I guess. Right. So I believe Enter always uses spears, so we want to get a decent spear. 
Uh, plus three. No. Not really interested in that. Let's plus two int and one resistance. I don't know. Let's see how you're doing. Might change some of your weapons, but for now, I'm just gonna save. And because I'm recording this on PS3, I have to do some audio syncage and stuff, which is a pain in the butt. So I'm going to stop it here for now, and I will pick it up when I've sorted that out. So I'll probably record a little set of about 25 minutes, maybe. Okay, so thank you for watching. If you liked, then like it. If you didn't, up to you. Bye bye.